The Neighborhood Savior, a guide to dealing with blighted properties. A blighted property can be a major issue for a neighborhood, affecting property values, public safety, and overall community morale. It's important for homeowners to understand the steps they can take to deal with a blighted property in their neighborhood. In this article, we'll provide tips and information on how to address this issue, from identifying a blighted property to working with local authorities to find a solution. Identifying a blighted property A blighted property is any property that has become a public nuisance, either through neglect or abandonment. Common signs of a blighted property include overgrown vegetation, broken windows, and a general state of disrepair. It's important to report any blighted properties you come across to your local authorities, as they may be a hazard to public health and safety. Working with local authorities once you've identified a blighted property, it's important to take action. The first step is to contact your local authorities and report the property. This can be done through your local government's website or by calling the appropriate department. Your local authorities will then conduct an investigation and determine if the property is indeed a blighted property. If the property is found to be a blighted property, the local authorities will work with the property owner to find a solution. This may include finding the property owner, requiring them to clean up the property, or even taking legal action to seize the property. Tips for dealing with a blighted property While local authorities play a major role in dealing with a blighted property, there are also steps that homeowners can take to address the issue. Here are some tips to help you deal with a blighted property in your neighborhood. Get to know your neighbors, building a strong community can help you identify and address blighted properties more effectively. By working together, you can have a greater impact on your neighborhood and the surrounding area. Organize a neighborhood cleanup. Hosting a neighborhood cleanup event can help to remove any eyesores and beautify the area. This can also show the property owner that their neglectful behavior is not acceptable. Report the property. Reporting a blighted property to local authorities is the first step in addressing the issue. Be sure to provide as much information as possible, such as the address, photographs, and any other relevant details. Attend community meetings. Attending community meetings and speaking with local authorities about the blighted property can help to bring attention to the issue and find a solution. Partner with local organizations. Partnering with local organizations, such as neighborhood associations or nonprofits, can help to provide additional resources and support in dealing with a blighted property. Dealing with a blighted property can be a difficult and time consuming process but it's important to take action to protect your neighborhood and improve the quality of life for all residents. By following these tips and working with local authorities, you can help to address the issue and find a solution. Summary A blighted property can have a negative impact on a neighborhood, affecting property values, public safety, and community morale. Homeowners can take action by reporting the property to local authorities, attending community meetings, and partnering with local organizations. With persistence and determination, you can help to address the issue and make your neighborhood a better place to live. Please feel free to contact us at youtube at